You guys ask for a bag check. Find out which bag I'm going to be checking. This one or this one. Now the decision is, I'm showing you this bag. So what I was thinking is, a lot of you guys have seen our bag checks. We've done really big bag checks and looked through our whole bag, but we haven't really talked about what we bring to tournaments. So I'm going to talk to you about what I actually bring to my tournaments and show you what's inside this bag. So let's get rid of this one. And let's take a look at this one. So first of all, this bag is a bit different to the one we got last year. I feel like it's much more easier to put stuff in. It's bigger as well. And first off, this pouch at the front here, and these two side pouches, one of them has an aluminium thing, so if I have some drinks or something I need to put in there, I can put it in there. And normally my phones and my accessories go in here so I don't lose them. And so let's get onto the racket, the main attraction. I've got three of my 98S Wilson blades here with countervail. One of the strings is broken at the moment, which I didn't bring out. So it's, I have four technically. And so let's get into the rest of the bag and see what I've got in here. So now we've got my bag. First of all, we've got a cap. Like if the weather's like it is now at the moment, which is really sunny, you're definitely gonna need one of these. Um, I'll normally choose the morning before my tournament what kind of color cap I want, depending on what I'm wearing at the moment. It's probably gonna be a white cap. And let's look into the rest of it. So normally I carry around uh, like a med kit or a med bag, but I normally have the big bag. So when I come to tournaments, I always take these four things. I have deep heat, deep freeze, uh, like a plaster and some antibacterial gel, uh, just for if I get hurt, a graze, fall over. Uh, I don't really want to be waiting forever for some person with a plaster to come, so I normally just take initiative and take these with me. I would highly recommend them, they're quite useful. Okay, so next one, my tennis book. Very important when I'm writing down notes or maybe reading in the match, maybe I'm down, I have to think about what I need to do better, maybe I've played them before. I keep all of that in here and I find this is really important, so you should definitely get one of these if you don't have one of these already. Not this specific book, but any book will do. Uh, just to write down your thoughts, maybe on the match, maybe while you're playing, even to get some anger out. But I think this is really good when I'm a bit frustrated just to read it and I calm down. So now onto the warm-up utensils. So, first off I have some shoelace, because I break my laces a lot from sliding. And then we've got a resistance band here and a tools skipping rope that we unboxed in a video, I don't know, about a month ago. So go and watch that if you haven't already. There's a lot of other cool, cool tool stuff that I do use in that video. Okay, so now if the weather's like this, you're going to be sweating a lot, especially if you have more than one or two matches. So I always bring a spare pair of clothes usually so that they match my shoes or they're colour coordinated. So I have a Biddy Badu t-shirt here and then some shorts to go with that and then a spare pair of socks, especially if you're playing on the clay. I'm pl I've got a tournament today and I'm playing on the clay so these are very helpful uh, so that my shoe socks don't get really red. Um, suntan cream, important, these like today. And now my shoes, so at the moment I'm wearing these Ultra Boosts, very comfortable. Uh, that's what I go to tournaments in, but obviously when I'm playing in tournaments I'm wearing my Nike Ultra Re Reacts. Um, I got these the other day from Podirect, thank you very much for these shoes, I really like them. I've tried them on quite a bit and they haven't really worn, that's what I like, because up here they've got really good caging, haven't really worn at all. And I really enjoy these, they're light but they're also durable. So I highly recommend them. And so yeah, finish my bag. That's everything that I will bring to a tournament. So if you think I've forgotten anything or something that I don't have that you have that you think is quite important, leave a comment down below and tell us your thoughts. So if you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified when our next video comes out. See you in the next video.